Today, Louisiana lawmakers created a second black majority congressional district, as well as a closed primary system for a handful of elections. Now, the special session adjourned four days before the Tuesday deadline. The state's six member congressional delegation will get new election boundaries after the Senate gave final approval to the legislation. Now, the maps call for Congressman Garrett Graves current district to be carved up for the new district. It would run from Baton Rouge to Shreveport. The question now is, will a federal judge approve the map to comply with the Voting Rights Act? We know the math, 33 percent of the state being African-American, having six congressional districts. There was always a very strong case to be made for two districts. But anybody who's ever been through redistricting at any level knows that it is one of the most difficult things. And it's very, very challenging. And there's no perfect map. So I'm not suggesting in any way that this map is perfect, but it meets the legal requirements. Lawmakers also approved closed party primaries for the state's federal elections, state Supreme Court justices, as well as members of the Board of Elementary and Secondary Education. U.S. Senator John Kennedy brokered a last minute deal to allow Louisiana voters who aren't affiliated with a party to vote in the closed primary of their choice. Both bills now head to the governor's desk.